Hey guys. Max B here. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> it is just frozen berries and water. It's so good. Oh, he got some banana lids, guys. So I just finished a killer workout. I, I did, uh, first thing first, I warmed myself up. I did 100 squats and punches. I squat, punch, punch with each arm. Then after I warmed up, I was like, okay, get loose. I was loose. I was like, I'm feeling it. I did five Zumba dances. Well, I did three, and then I had to let Daisy out. Then I did two more. And then there were some 10-pound weights over there. I did 10 lifts on each arm, three, three reps of that. I just feel like lifting weights, you know, just to see if I can pull up, muster up my strength. And, uh, because I'm sick and tired of having jobs that I can't physically handle because I'm too, my, I'm too physically weak up top. I have no upper body strength. And, uh, so I, I got that. And then I went outside and I went back and forth between the porch and the back fence five times. Like, back there to the porch one. And then I did that basically ran, you know. Didn't even get a full length of a song in, so it, it, didn't, it didn't take me too long. I'm going to have to up that um, tomorrow. But I've decided to do that for next, you know, month with excluding Sundays. Because I don't, I don't, don't want to work on a Sunday, obviously. Um, but uh, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to see how much my body can handle and push myself to be better. So let's let's get into this smoothie. I may have to go get a spoon because it's a little thick. Like, that's like jiggly moving. It's belly moving. It looks really good. I love dark smoothies like that. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And we'll see you next clip. Get the breakfast in. She's actually asleep. Wait, no, she's waking up a little bit. Oh, I hate when she does it. She rolls her eyes in the back of her head. Uh, you want to see something awesome, guys? Pull it up. Our guy socks. Look at that. Our guy socks. But I'll just have to deal. I'll just have to deal with it. So it is now 10:32. I just finished my breakfast, but that's because I got up at eight, exercised for about an hour and I don't think it wasn't a full hour. It wasn't even a full hour. It was like it was like close to like. I didn't even I didn't start working out right at eight. It was like nine thirty when I got done. I started working around like no, it wasn't nine thirty when I got done. Nine fifteen maybe. So I worked for like forty five minutes, thirty to forty five minutes. I don't know exactly the time. I don't measure how much time I work, but anyway, I told you what I did and everything. But then I started. Eat, I made my breakfast, and it took a while because I'd let the berries soak because they wouldn't. <laughs> Oh, two more days and she'll be one. Oh my gosh. But, um, I'm just sitting here catching up on old vlogs of, like, all my favorite vloggers since I have to, like, I don't have to. Well, I do. I have to download and not watch because I'm trying to watch YouTube on my computer just does not work. So, yeah. <laughs> and my breakfast is late because I take a long time to eat. I try to pace myself. I don't try. I. I used to be really bad, and I've gotten a lot better at it. Sometimes. But sometimes I get pretty bad at it. To eat slower. And I'm also trying to get be better at looking at the camera when I'm talking and not speaking like this. <laughs> talking to my legs. But anyway. <laughs> that's just a little random clip I wanted to tell you. I wanted to show you something. I ate that berry smoothie. And, like, my finger has this big purplish mark. This purple mark on it. It would just focus already. Focus. Ugh, oh, focus. Here we go. 
Like, it's just it's weird, and I can't... See, I just licked it. I cannot get it to come off. Nothing. And my legs are really hairy. I have to shave. <laughs> yes, I shave. <laughs> Um, I have a big to-do list to do today, but I'm going to get into it. I have a lot to do today. Let's see. Oh, wow, I do have a lot to do today. Anyway, <laughs> let's get to it. Hey, guys, I want to show you my OOTD. I'm, like, shaking. I'm steady it. Okay. 50% mermaid. 30. 6% unicorn. Uh, 14% flawless, which I wish it said awesome. I showed you this last night, but this is it. Wearing these black pants and black socks that actually have. Mm. They have gray argyle on them, so that is my outfit for the day. But yeah, that's, that's me. Hi. Alright. So, oh, Daisy, get over here, come on, move, move over there, baby, move over there. But I don't want to move, Mommy, what you doing? Well, I'm such a good girl, yes, and I never misbehave, though I chew on everything. Hey guys, so I just wanted to, um, talk to you. Because I keep forgetting to, I just got out of the shower, so I just keep forgetting to say that um, I have a, uh, some books I want to recommend to you guys. Uh, obviously, the China Study, I read that one, and it was really good. It's something that will stick with me, and I'll keep reading it over and over. Um, there's this one series that I read, it was three books, um, by Beth Revis. I don't know if I'm saying that right, Revis, R-E-V-I-S, but yeah, I'm sure you know how to spell Beth, but um, her book, her, the first one's called Across the Universe, then A Million Suns, then shades of earth all three of those books are so awesome and let me just say shout out to beth revis she had me gripping the book and really immersed into the story and so immersed that i actually started saying the words that were in the book like it's a book about um uh space <laughs> it's a fiction book a uh, fiction series um and it's uh about how there, uh, there is this one girl and her family and tons of other people that her family works with are frozen in a uh, pile on a ship 300 years later actually it, it's supposed to be 300 years later but it's a lot l way later than that actually um, she's woken up early by one of the, the future leader of the ship and it just shows their story and how there's ton there's over two thousand shipborns. There's almost three thousand shipborns. And it shows their story of getting to this next planet. And Sol Earth is the first planet, Centauri Earth is the new planet, and it's just so cool. I don't wanna give away too much of the book. But these books are so cool. And in there they don't cuss like Sol Earth people do. Uh which is, I'm like literally saying it still now. It they say Frex or F R E X. And stars, that's a cuss word too, apparently. And everything's so brilly, which is, like, I guess awesome. But I found my I found myself saying Frex all the time. It was so cool. So definitely check those books out. I know I'm, like, way... But I don't want my hair is about to fall down. Anyway, check those books out. You will love them. How many of you out there love to sit and read? Like... I like sitting and reading. There's nothing wrong with listening to books on audible.com. I'm not spot never going to be sponsored by them. But I'm just saying, it's so much more fun to sit and read and immerse yourself in the book completely, you know? Because I feel like you get a different experience, obviously, yes. And you don't take as long to read the book as you do to listen to it. <laughs> well, I mean, me, because I, I tend to speak, I, I speed read, but not like so much that I miss the story. I just kind of read fast. Like I talk fast. Anyway, let's get rest. I just wanted to recommend those books. And I got three other books over there that I'm going to be reading. We shall see if they're worth talking about. Um, let's see, did I have any other books? I had some more books out, but I don't remember them. They weren't, like, I guess I didn't get enough into them that I wanted to mention them, you know? So, anyway. Oh, I don't remember who it's by. I feel horrible, but it's My Unfair Godmother and My Fair Godmother. 
I haven't read the My Fair Godmother. I only got the one was my unfair. Couldn't buy the My Fair one. I'm gonna request my um, My Fair Godmother. But um, yeah, I don't remember who it's by. I'm horrible. I read it a long time ago, so that's why I don't remember. A couple months ago, but it was such a good. It was so hilarious. So definitely read those two. All right, I'll see you guys next time. I'll see you guys okay. next. Time. Hey guys, so here's lunch. It's a salad. All that romaine, uh, tomatoes, cucumbers, bell pepper. It's a small salad, but I'm also having a vegan sandwich. That is a Boca chicken patty. It's just a soy, it's soy and other plant-based, um, like I think there's corn in there. And this bread is, um, 100%, it's, it may be high in sodium, but it's 100% vegan. There's no lactate in it or any other, um, milk products. There's lettuce, tomato, and ketchup on there. And I know ketchup's not the greatest for you, but... This is going to be delicious. And, um, totally smacking there, sorry. I've had this vegan chicken patty a million times. A million and one times. But, um, I just tried the spicy chicken one yesterday. And it was amazing. Definitely give those a try. Uh, going shopping t later today, so I'm going to give you a haul. And that is it for Let's Get Into This Lunch. Hello, it is the sunlight. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, just sunlight seeing weaving into your pores. There's Daisy. I don't know what she's eating. It looks pretty gross. <laughs> I can't catch her, so I don't even try. But, it is such a beautiful day out here. I'm loving life right now. I got one posted already uh, from like two days ago. So I decided to post a couple more. Let me go in the shade so you can actually see me. <laughs> I'm not like completely glaring in the sun. Anyway, eh, shade, need you. Alright, so uh, I got one uploaded. I'm going to upload two more if I can get them to edit right. Because I think I figured out how to edit this a little bit. Oh my gosh, look at this cute little puppy over here. Let's zoom in, zoom in. Hello. Focus. Focus, focus. Zoom out a little bit. Focus. Focus. Look at that little booger right there. Aww. Who? Okay, if you don't know who... Uh, okay, let me zoom back out. Alright. So, before... I had Daisy... Before we uh, got Daisy, we had another dog named Puka. Her name was Puka. We first, she, her, first, her name started out as being Snowball, but she never answered to that. Except for once, when I called her Snowball on the first day we got her. But then, she started answering to Puka, so I was like, Puka it is. <laughs> And pook, stuff like that. And she was our puppy for I don't know. She's probably she's a puppy for quite a while. And that dog reminds me of Puka. And Daisy is like stalking the dog right now. Daisy, Daisy, she's so pretty. Okay, let's zoom back out. I'm still learning how to use this. Even after having this camera for over two years now, I'm still learning. Three years now. I'm two years. Two and a half years. I'm still learning how to use certain functions on it because I'm very... For the most part, I'm checky later. I'm not as bad as some. I do know how to do a few things, but... <laughs> anyway. Uh, so, today was such a good day. I got so much done, and I'm going to get a lot more done. In a few, a little bit, I'm going to upload those two if I can. Figure out how to edit. I figured out a little bit. I watched a video on how to edit on YouTube without any editing software. I figured a little bit out. So we're going to try that. And then we're going to see. This battery light may flash soon. Oh, yeah, I'm about to die. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to show you guys this beautiful sunlight. Like, the sun seeps into your pores. Oh. I'm a summer baby, and I love the sun. I love being in the sun. I love the sun itself, and it gives me so much life. Okay, <laughs> I'm being random and strange, and today's been such a good day, and I've just been loving my outfit, bro. 
like I got my uh, heart ring on, skull and crossbone ring on I've had for seven years now. Wait, no. Okay, wait. <laughs> Oh, I'm coming up on eight years of having it, of having this ring. This ring right here. Let me look at this thing. It doesn't even look like skull and crossbones. It looks like poodles. All the sequins are gone. I've told, I said this a million times, but that is it's my favorite ring. My best friend bought it for me. I have this bracelet on, feeling very emo-esque, but without the makeup. Got this uh, this bracelet. I got at, I got this bracelet at Walmart for a dollar. This was at. I want to say this was at Claire's, but I cannot remember where I got this one. This was at Claire's, and this is from... I also want to say Claire's, too. I, don't, I have uh, my... Um, I don't know if I'm showing it, but I have my Infinity uh, earrings on. And that's... That's about it. I don't feel very emo, but I'm wearing literally all black except for my tennis shoes. <laughs> oh. And the gold on my t-shirt. White, but... Without the, I used to be so emo. I used to like straighten my hair. Had like dark raccoon eyes. So yeah. But that's about it for today. Bye. Hey guys. So um, I just wanted to film a little like goodbye clip because like in the vlog, you know. But um, let's go up here. I just brushed my hair. Like so cute. You can see my vlogger arm, can't you? <laughs> I'm really goofy. I just finished lunch. It was so incredibly good. I just love the focus stuff. Oh my gosh. You will not believe how hairy my socks are. Look at this. And that's just from walking and sitting on this bed. My pants and my shirt is worse. Like, what is this? And look at the bottom. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That is so horrible. I'm going to be lint rolling like crazy. Probably for like 30 minutes I'll be lint rolling. <laughs> anyway, I'm about to go. I'm going to put you guys in here. And then I'm going to go uh, label you guys. And then I'm going to uh, get all the hair off me. And go to the library. And upload and get something. And finally, because I got YouTube Red. So I can download ATTY. I'm so excited to see ATTY. Finally, I'm like two days behind. But I'm finally watching it. Just a couple days late. I mean, I'm still gonna tweet about it. Still gonna see everything about it. Still gonna do it on Instagram whenever I I got a few ideas coming up for some collabs with my with Sun Sweet Tea, since she's the only one who will collab with me. I also get an unboxing, and I might do a video with my dad. Hey, Dad, wanna unbox a video with me? Maybe we can find something to unbox. <laughs> anyway, I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to. Give this a big thumbs up if you liked it. And if you didn't like it, thumbs down and tell me why. Um, share this around. Favorite it. Tweet it. Facebook it. Instagram it. Whatever you want to do. Have fun with that. Uh, <laughs> comment down below what you would like to see. And tweet me questions. I already put it on my Twitter. Tweet me questions using the hashtag BFF tag. And because I want to do I'm going to be doing a video with her. That's my hope. I don't know if it's going to actually... This is my biggest hope, because, like, it's, like, a 90% 90 90 chance sure it's going to happen, so. We shall see. I got a big to-do list still to conquer. Still getting it done. <laughs> anyway. Thank you guys so much. I will see you guys next time. This is Mags B signing off for Vegan Bauer House. Watch out!